We recently interviewed a well-educated, fully certified, highly trained, and extensively experienced esthetician. Her experience included several years at a major national laser hair removal franchise. We were shocked to discover that in all those years of education, training, and experience, she had never been told about using atomized carbon as a photodynamic agent to enhance the effectiveness of laser and intense pulsed light hair removal treatments. Photon therapy works by raising the temperature of the tissues which support the viability of hair growth to the point that they are traumatized and effectively neutralized. Even dark hair is a poor conductor of photon energy, so even if the treatment area is shaved prior to application, only about 55% of the energy that strikes the surface of the skin makes it to the follicle. Blonde and gray hair are such poor energy conduits that many practitioners and equipment manufacturers simply say, don't even try. So could the apparent absence of training on this important topic be because it just doesn't work? The fact that we have so many regular customers who use it says otherwise, but so do independent clinical studies. For example, a short-term study showing the results of a single treatment after one month, comparing the hair regrowth after treatment by a laser with no hair removal prior, with waxing prior, and with waxing plus carbon dye shows that the treatment is twice as effective if the treatment area is first prepared by waxing and application of carbon dye. A second longer study showed that waxing and applying carbon dye requires only half as many treatments over a 12-week period to achieve much better results than laser shaving. This means that if the average treatment cost is $200 over a 12-week period, six treatments would cost $1,200 compared to $2,400 if it took 12 treatments to get the job done because the laser hair removal business did not use carbon dye to improve the efficiency of their equipment. Which would you rather pay? But if you own a big laser hair removal franchise, which would you rather collect? Considering that typical high production salon photo epilation systems cost from $40,000 to $100,000 or more, and beautiful billboards, print ads, and other media require a huge advertising budget, the answer is obvious. It certainly would not make good business sense for these high overhead operations to spend an extra dollar on each treatment for a few milliliters of carbon dye and cut the revenue in half. But for the home user on a limited budget, it makes all the sense in the world. It means that you can get great results from a high-quality personal laser system that costs $500 or less. And for the small salon or private practitioner, it means that you can equip your practice with a higher capacity laser or pulsed light system for $1,000 to $3,500 and do a fantastic job for your customers at irresistibly competitive prices and get lots of referrals.